Hello guys, how are you? Welcome to the next episode of City Skylines with me, Biffa. How are you keeping? Well, I hope. Why are we staring at this lovely, swift-moving road junction here? Well, today, as you probably guessed by the title of the video, we are going to be working with the Traffics++ Plus Plus mod. Yes, finally got it working! Now have the tools available to me to be able to change the road junctions like we wanted. Let me quickly tell you how to do that because it's not turned on by default. If you go to your main menu of the game, go to your content manager, scroll, go to the mod section, you pick that on the left, scroll up and down until you find the Traffic++ Plus Plus mod, click the options button and it gives you a little window and there's some little check mark boxes you can turn on and off. The bottom three a beta and one of them is called something like road configuration tool click that one load up your game and you will now have this little button down here road customizer tool that's it not configuration you click on that you now have the option look you can highlight let's go here highlight junctions you can highlight lanes you can do all sorts of things you have the option of Letting only certain things use lanes, lanes be certain speeds. We're going to look at all of that in a minute. I've also used the road colour change tool, which I quite like. It's sort of slightly darker colour, makes your roads stand out a bit better. I like that. How is the traffic going up here, by the way? Still a humongous queue for people to get in up here. Goodness me. Actually, why don't we look at this junction here? Is this... So this is all one lane. Do you know what we need to do? Pause the game. Before we jump into doing all of this, we need to upgrade this road here to a two-lane road. And do you know what? I'm going to add bus lanes to it as well. It's got to be two-lane one-way. Do we have a one-way with bus lanes? I don't think we do. This is one-way, just a busway. Mm, that's a shame. I was hoping we'd have one of these with a bus lane. These are just bus lanes, aren't they? Small bus lane, small bus lane. Um, I just had no idea so much traffic would be coming into here. We could use something a lot bigger. Six lane road with buses. It's a shame we don't have one way with buses. That just seems a bit odd. I suppose it's because all the traffic's going that way anyway. So it probably doesn't really matter, does it? Let's pick... Two lane one way. We're going to upgrade all of these. Hopefully with no problem. And then at the end we can play with the junction a bit. To hopefully... Ah oh yes, some of these buildings are going to be removed. There we go. So, let's just watch all the traffic disappear. <laughs> so the traffic is going to come in here. And what lanes are they going to use? So at the minute everybody is still using the right hand lane. There we go, right hand lane, right hand lane. These guys are like cutting across each other. So the first thing we're going to do is pause the game. We're going to look at these lanes here. So I can select this junction. Left click. As such, here. The game will freeze. The game will come back. There we go. Maybe that was why it was, while it was saving or something. And we can click on these lanes here. And now we can tell these lanes where they can go. So... You notice that says straight on, this says straight on and right, so does this. So we can say that one can go there. In fact, what I would probably do is only have that one as the one coming off. And this one here as the ones going straight along. So he can go there and there. And he can go there. Just to try and keep the traffic moving a bit. Let's see... It takes a while for your traffic then to to kick into this new way of working. Yeah, see some of those disappeared. They're moving over because they want to go straight on. So some of these cars were spawned way over here with their route already mapped out. It's not until they new cars appear that they will start getting into the correct lane. So hopefully that will stop all of this tailback that we're seeing because let's have a look down here where does that start so let's just click on let's turn that off again and look at this junction here so immediately they're all coming in and switching over look over to there 
So I think what we're going to do is, if this works, is set these to go just whoops, just straight on. I want to see if I can even out this traffic. There we go. Like that. And then this one can go to here, here, or here, depending on where they want to go to. So hopefully that will help. And then pe what I want to do is get people to start using all the lanes. So we'll come back to that. We'll have a look at that in a sec. So now, oh, here we go. Look, people are using two lanes. Oh, what's happened here? Did we not upgrade these roads correctly? We've done that. We've done that. We've done that. Why is that? There we go. So that should be going in, shouldn't it? We've got the roads coming out over here. Yeah, okay, there we go. Well, that wouldn't have helped, would it? And then what I want here is this junction done correctly. So turning right can go to here, here, or here. That's fine. This one straight over can go to here. Is that two lane? That's one way. Yeah, that can go to there, so that's fine. And then this one here. To here, here, or here. Here, here, or here. Straight over, also. To here, here, or here. And then I only want this one to go round to there. There we go. So let's work around the junction, do the other ones. So turning right. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I want left click. There, there, or there. That's good. And then turning... Yeah, I want it actually to go over here as well. There we go. And then leaving this junction. You can see the traffic is working well already. So there should be nothing in this lane unless it's going to turn right. So we're not going to get anybody crossing over. Good. So again, turning right to there. Straight over to there, there, and there. So this is a good idea of a junction. Then here we can go left as well. So I only want that one to go left. Where's the little thing? There it is. Oh no, that's a way in, isn't it? Of course, yes. Okay, well let's do just to that one there. Just to even out the traffic a bit. So that... We shouldn't see anybody in the wrong lanes now. And people are using the correct lane apart from this guy. <laughs> but again, as we said, some of these may have spawned with the wrong information on before it even started. That is cleared up already. Look at that. So something as simple as that can just get things moving. So there's a lot of cars here. Just watching what's happening. So they're all in the right-hand lane. Let's just make sure they're all turning right and not going anywhere else. Let's speed that up a bit. Uh, yep. Let's sped up. Cars do not seem to be going any faster. There we go. So you should be able to go... We could turn the traffic lights off. That is another mod that can be added. So what are these on? Red at the moment. There we go. We're going to green. Let's just watch. Yeah. They're just turning right. So maybe something we could do to fix that to get... Oh, hang on. They're turning right. They're going round the end. And then coming back here. Ah, right, you can see why, because this one, there we go, didn't have anybody, no way for anybody to turn left, so that can go straight on, left, and not right, yeah, that's it, so I made a mistake there, okay, oh, that guy there, what's he doing, driving on the road, oh, is he going to go and park over here, is he, where is that guy going? Let's follow him and see. He's now going in the road, under the road, underground. Okay. Ah, there we go. Look. So people should start shifting lanes. There he is. He's come back up again. Now he's turned around to park. That was very freaking weird. That's better. That's much better. 
So things like that, and we've alleviated all of that tailback. That is fantastic. And that will help on things like this as well. I mean, if we look at the roundabout, where was the one I was looking at earlier? This one here. Now, how a roundabout should work, so this is the way, let's look at this. If we're in the UK, I mean, I'm assuming this is the same all around the world. If you were going to go, let me just get my bearings. Say we were going to go over here, we're going to come off here. Or straight on, there we go, so this is straight on. So we're coming on here, this lane would be for turning right. That slows down a lot there, doesn't it? You should check a few things like that. This lane would be for going right. This lane would be for going left and straight on. But if we look at some of these cars, let's follow that bus. So where's he going? So he's gone straight on, that's fine. This yellow car came in the left-hand lane. Where's he going? He's going round. He's cut across that lane there. So that would have slowed down any traffic in that lane. Look, lots of them are doing that from the middle one. So what we need to do up here... We'll start with this junction, and I'll do some off-camera. If we click there, what we need is nobody in that lane turning right. We just want that one turning right. Then this one can go to there and there, and that one goes around the outside again. That is how, that to me, is how a roundabout should work. So if you're going off, you're in there. The middle, maybe you're coming off next or going straight on. And the outside one, you're sticking in the outside. So he's still done that. Let's just see whether... Let's come out of that. Hopefully, any new cars that spawn now won't do that. Well, I'll tell you what, let me do the other junctions on the roundabout. There's a junction there. <laughs> Odd. Oh, it's like a road join. Let me do the other junction on the roundabout, see if we can get this running... I mean, it's running okay, but let's see if we can get it running better without anybody cutting across anybody else. I'm just watching... I think, actually, that's working already, isn't it? Oh, yeah, see that lorry? So let's quickly just look at this one before we go. Before I go. So that... That is only one lane out. Yeah, so he's going to have to go there, there, or there anyway. So, yeah, there's not much we can change there. Alright, let me fiddle around with this roundabout. And uh, I'll show you the results in a moment. Okay, we're back. Just got it paused here, just to sort of have a look roughly at what I've done here. So most of these, what I've done is I've got the, the road that's coming in just joining to the right. The other three going straight on. And uh, when you're coming off as well, one lane coming off, that one going to two. And always the outside one sort of getting priority straight on. Oh, this one I've not done right, have I? So let me show you how you can change that then. Click the junction, click the spot, take it off of there. And take it off of there. That's it. So we only want it coming in on the right. And then if it needs to change lane afterwards, it can, can it? Mm. So this is where you've got to be careful. We could do a slightly longer roads between junctions. Because now I'm assuming that that can only go there. And once we're here, that one can only go there and there. So I've got to be careful what I'm doing. So maybe... That one I will put back onto those two, just because it's such a short junction. But again, oh, and this one here, let's right click to get back into that mode. That one I'm going to take off there and just have it on the outside. Left click, no, left click, left click. There we go. So that one can come off. That's a slightly wider road it's coming off. So I've got two ways of coming off there. I'm hoping I've done this okay. And as we've got three lanes coming on here, I've spread it out. So it's really depending on each junction. I've taken sort of each junction as I've seen it. Now this I want to change. I don't want that going to there. I want it just coming into there. See, this is another one. Because it's such a small... It's going to come into here and only be able to go right. And then it's going to go all the way down there, round around, right back up. Yeah, so maybe I will add that to all three. As it's not a very busy roundabout anyway, so it shouldn't be a problem. Let's unpause that. Let's turn that off. And let's just observe some traffic. And see whether we notice any bottlenecks or changes or things like that. Yeah, you see, I might need to just be careful. Because they're going to come into this lane and only then be able to go off. And that's it. So... 
what I do need to do is have this give you a straight on option. Yeah, there we go. Well, he went straight on even though... Did I actually add that as an option? Oh yeah, they're cutting across the lane. So let's just add that to there as well. There we go. Yeah, so it might need to be careful. You could make catastrophic mistakes. <laughs> with using this mod but hopefully not too bad but I'm loving the way that you can whoops dive around your city and start sort of fiddling with things making changes and hopefully getting things running better I want that going to there there I want that so we don't have a straight on but that could go to there and that one could go to there and I've got nothing else before. It's going from a one lane. So people can choose. As soon as they hit here, they can choose where they're going to go. And hopefully ease that congestion there. Because at the minute, everyone's just sitting in this right-hand lane for no reason at all. And that's the idea of this mod. Just to give you a bit more control over things and, and help with things. Let's go back over here. Yeah, you see, look... No, no tailbacks at all along there. Excellent. What's he moaning about? Yeah, okay. One other thing. <laughs> Forget that. He can sort himself out. One other thing. Oh, excuse me. Let me just have a quick sip of tea. Still getting over the sore throat. Talking for extended periods of time. One other thing you can do. Is if we do this, you can pick lanes as well. Look at that. Let's just zoom into this straight bit of road. I can pick one of these three lanes that's here. Let's pick this outside one. And is that going to let me change the speed? I can change the speed. So that's what it is at the moment, 100. I can up the speed or lower the speed for certain lanes. I can also only allow certain vehicles in certain lanes as well. Now that is very interesting. On the motorways in the UK, only cars would be allowed in the outside lane. So this lane here... So no trucks would be allowed. And if we pick that lane, everything's allowed in there. We could disallow. That's garbage trucks. Cargo trucks. We could disallow. Coaches would be okay. And buses. Cars, obviously. Garbage trucks wouldn't. Hearses would because they're cars. And emergency vehicles could. So you could really have some fun trying to sort of design all the different ways that your roads could work with this mod and I'm wondering whether we could up the speed let's just have a look around see here's another little if you see people only using one lane see they're all sort of clumping together here so for some reason they're all clumping together and then they're messing around to go up there so let me see if I can fix that Right, done some fiddling. I'll tell you what, this is addicting. As soon as you start fiddling around with some junctions, you want to just do all of them. But yes, I've eased off the traffic here. It takes a while, like I said, for the traffic to sort of go through, new traffic to be formed, new cars to be formed, to then realise how the roads work. You still will see some people sort of crossing lanes a bit weirdly. Actually, what we need to do here is take that one. That one does need to be able to go into any of the lanes. There we go. They will sort of... Yeah, there we go. And then when they get over here, I've got just this lane coming off and the other one's going on, like we see before. The same here. So we've always got the outside lane that goes along. And then what I've done here... See, I don't know. I'm just looking at this. Oh, there's no... There is junctions in the middle here between roads. Which is a bit odd. And I don't know whether I need to do anything with those. Just to... I don't think I do. I think I'll leave those and just concentrate on the ones at the end. What I've done with these roads up here... See, now this is interesting. This was wrong. I had this little stretch at the top as a two-way road. So three of these lanes weren't being used at all. Um, but now we have... And I've done a little bit of jiggly-pokey. So the right lane just goes... Let's just click on the junction... Right lane just goes right. That one will go right and straight on. Because what I've done is these lanes here, I've made this just a bus lane and nothing else. Let's click out of that. And then whoop, and then this one. Come on, let me do it. 
That one there. Oh, it's changed. Uh, it's selecting more lanes than I actually want to select. That one there is just a bus lane. Okay. Let's turn that one off. That one should be just emergency vehicles. That's what I set up. Because that one can also go to everything, can it? No, it can't. That is not the one. Oh, nearly messed up the whole thing. That one, there we go. That's just emergency vehicles. That will go left, straight on, and right. That makes sense. And that's just a bus lane. That will go left, straight on, and right as well. I was hoping to try and sort of split the traffic up a little bit. See if that helped. But people are definitely using all the lanes. We're still getting some lane divers, as I like to call them. Suddenly at the last minute changing their mind. But they may be ones that spawned after I change things. But it's freed it up here. But then to try and sort of alleviate that. I went to the next junction. Did the same. Then went to the next junction. And went to the next junction. Then stopped when I got to this. Because that's, <laughs> that's working fine. I'm not fiddling with that. But then I dived into here. And this has actually got a lot better as well. I've got a lot of police cars there. Let's click on this junction and see what's going on. Oh, so they're going, they're going in, aren't they? Yep, of course. So they want to go straight over or left. That's fine. They can go straight. So what I've done is done, again, what you have in the UK. is The right lane is always turning right. See, if I... Let me just change that there. If I, see, that's only got a right arrow on. If I put that also straight over, it does change the arrow on the street. That is fantastic. I didn't realise. So that should be just turning right, and that should be left and straight on. And again, that's what I've done all the way around all the different junctions. Right, left, straight on. And the same here. Right, straight on, left if there's three lanes, two lanes right, left and straight on. So, it is... It, it helps you then see as well where you're going to need some upgrades, because some of these roads aren't just aren't big enough to hold the traffic. So, three lane... Instead of two lane would be good. And what have we got here? See, this is a junction I haven't even touched. What have we got going on here? A lot of different things. See, some of these are straight on. Some of them are left. So I could fiddle with that. Lots of fun to be had with the Traffic Plus Plus mod. So hopefully that's shown you how it works. And you can see for yourself. And it works with things like we've got the one-way arrows going again. There we go, which is good. Colour change mod. All the other sorts of mods now. Loads are being upgraded to work. I want to start getting some bus lane ones going in. Now we've got those. We might need to sort of have a look around and see where would be a good spot for those. But it's... Look at that. So much traffic has been alleviated just by people using roads correctly. That is fantastic. So... I'm going to start zoning a little bit more stuff up here. We need a bit of high density commercial. And I'm going to say, guys, I will see you next time. Thank you very, very much for watching. Do appreciate it. Don't forget to leave a like. Hopefully you've learned something from this mod as well. This guy has been complaining about trash. Why? Can people not get to him or something? <laughs> Do you know what? They can't. Look. His road is not connected. Good job, I checked. Oh, you can also use your scroll wheel, which is fantastic. Uh, I believe that's two, two lane one way. Is that what we want? That's a two lane road. Why can I not connect that up to there? That is weird. What is this place? A high school. Hmm, well, that's why we, that's why all these people are complaining. I'm going to sort that out, and I will see you guys next time. Thanks for watching. Take care.